Arthur Davenport FRA, S. 1891 to 1976 was a British aircraft engineer working for Westland Aircraft. When the Westland Aircraft Works was created by the Petter Twins in 1915, Arthur was one of the first droughtsmen to be recruited from Petters Limited. He was chief designer from 1919, working under the direction of Teddy Petter from May 1934 until 1944, when Petter left to join English Electric and Davenport became technical director. According to Harold Penrose, he was made the scapegoat for the late delivery of the Wyvern and headed into retirement in March 1952. In the 1920s, when most aircraft were biplanes, Arthur was a strong proponent of the monoplane. Most of his monoplane designs were high winged or parasol, culminating in the Lysander. During his career, he was involved in the design of the following fixed wing aircraft Westland Limousine Chief Droughtsman. Westland Wagtail Chief Droughtsman, Designer Westland Weasel Chief Droughtsman, Designer Westland Woodpigeon Westland Widgeon Chief Designer Westland Wizard Westland Wapiti, Wallace Westland Interceptor Westland Wessex Westland PV.3 Westland Wallace Westland PV.7 Westland F730 Westland Lysander Westland Whirlwind Westland Welkin Westland Wyvern Technical Director In the early 1930s he worked with Juan de la Sierva to develop the Sierva C.29 and Sierva CL.20 autogyros. It was this interest in rotary-winged aircraft that would lead Westland to manufacture Sikorsky helicopters in the early 1950s. Topic. Patents GB Patent 742240, Arthur Davenport, "...improvements in or relating to apparatus for facilitating landing of aircraft," issued 21 December 1955, assigned to Westland Aircraft Limited. <laughs> Notes <laughs>